I think that the biggest takeaway from this course is understanding people's points of views and discussing tough issues that many of the times we, we choose not to discuss because they're so sensitive in, in nature. Navy Region Japan held another bilateral non-commissioned officer leadership continuum, but this time at Naval Air Facility at Sugi, and invited members of the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force and United States Army Japan. The course facilitates in-depth discussion of issues facing modern militaries, including transgender implementation, sailor resiliency, and women in the workplace. Uh, we gave them very difficult topics to discuss, which the participants never think about if they're working at the, their individual unit. This will make their, their job easy when they become a senior leader. As a bilateral exercise forging a closer relationship between America and Japanese service members, it didn't only take place inside the classroom. The participants toured both an American helicopter squadron and a Japanese P-1 squadron and got together after hours to play softball and enjoy some barbecue. My overall experience with the course was uh, amazing. We spoke about very tough um, topics and we definitely did not all agree um, or have the same thought process whenever discussing these issues, but we did come to a common ground, uh, which was usually acceptance and the wanting to better as a military. Reporting from your Naval Base, I'm Petty Officer Chase Hawley.